We've got a fresher version of this on the right, and we are going to give it a try. It'll be a little more fair comparison, and brothers don't shake, brothers got a hug. <laughs> All right, people. So, uh, I got a message. We're doing it live. I got a Facebook message from Earth Rider Brewery saying, I heard that you brewed our... Um, you know, recipe, and uh, the beer that you got wasn't the freshest. Where did you get it? Because we're always trying to figure out, like, you know, where it was and all this. And uh, end up being Allison, who was one of the brewers there, and a um, friend of mine, and former brewer at Thirsty Pagan. And uh, we had a nice discussion. I said I would did my best to be fair to the brewery because I knew that it wasn't the freshest. And she watched the video and she agreed. I was. So there you go. You're the fairest guy. I was I fair know. weather. Now again, I don't, you know, maybe not a huge deal, but mine has ended up being clearer than theirs. So you had the Earth Rider from October, came packaged in October. This They're is packaged in February. On the right side of that. That's lovely. Are we framed up? No. Really? Don't no. Know. There you go. Show your artwork, man. Don't <laughs> 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 Don't no, on the wall, that was your body. Oh, that. And like you show, I'm like, what? Um, now there's all this space between us. Um, there's little risk involved. There's a lot of molecular space. I took space too much too. for granted dark matter. Their, this beer, their beer is a lot better. I mean, it's like a nice, nicely made, good drinking house for my money. You can totally tell it's much fresher. Much. Than the, the, the packaging date of that last can, for sure. It's a it's a really nice, easy drinking, crisp mm -hmm. iteration of Alice. I think if you're obviously they're different, but they're also I would like say in the same ballpark. They're almost in the same minor league ballpark. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's not like fifty thousand. I don't know what I'm saying. They're both behind They're, the, the home team dugout, right? Yeah, right. One is the mascot, one is the pig that runs out between innings and carries the baseball to the ump. Well, I don't know. I, like, I think it's a fair recipe. I think it's a fair approximation of their recipe. I don't know that it's a um, little different, that different than like a lot of house recipes. I did comment in my video, I think it had more either Munich or Vienna than what I would usually use. Yeah, there is. Mm -hmm. And did you, you scaled that back, right? Well, I, I used a recipe. Like, they gave us percentages. Or, oh, yeah, no, they gave like a 15 gallon recipe or something. Okay. It was 10 or 15 gallons, I scaled it. Yeah, but just, I equally scaled it back. Because I passed third grade math. Congratulations. I know. That's my problem. I would happily drink either of these. I and agree. I, um, I, I like coming over here because within like 90 seconds of walking in the door, I usually have a couple beers in hand and a camera go. pointed at me. And one thing I found with my way that I logger with I logger it on tap, that's just kind of how I do it. It gets better and better and better after being in the fridge for a, com a couple of months, which is what it would normally just be in the cave or in the controlled, you know, temperature environment. Or the cave. Or the cave, AKA. But, um, yeah, so like this beer, my beer, I like better now than I did a couple months ago. It's more carbonated than the last it's time. It's more I carbonated. Had. And I think it gets a little crisper in here. Anyway, I wanted to be even more fair to Earth Rider and the great people up there. We have a lot of beer to drink. We're gonna keep drinking it, so. Cheers. Cheers. Catch you later.